Welcome back. The U.S. Women's National Hot Air Balloon Championship was supposed to be start today in Jackson, but due to the weather, it'll happen tomorrow. Either way, it all leads up to the Hot Air Jubilee scheduled for this Friday. So joining us now live in the studio to talk about this is Angela Madden, chairwoman of the board for these events. Angela, thank you so much for being here. My pleasure. Good morning, Megan. Good morning. So let's start with the U.S. Women's Championship. Can yeah. you tell us about that? Absolutely. So 16 of the country's best and brightest female hot air balloon pilots have made their way to Jackson to compete for the title of U.S. National Champion and the opportunity to fly in the World Championships in 2025. Okay, so this is big. This, this is, is a, a big one. This is a really big deal. This is our second year in Jackson hosting U.S. Women's National Championships. We had great experience last year. The women really loved coming to Michigan, and we're happy to have them back. Yeah, absolutely. So that will happen tomorrow, correct? Correct. correct. So the women will fly morning and evening flights, Tuesday through Friday, to compete. They'll have several tasks laid out in front of them by the event directors. Um, and when they will actually take a, a baggie with a tail on it, a long straight Streamer, we like to call it, and have to throw it at an X on the ground. Oh. Person who gets their baggie closest to the center of the X scores the most points, and then they accumulate okay. points throughout the week. Cool. Okay, I did not know this was a thing. <laughs> this is awesome. Um, now, this kind of leads into, I know they're two separate events, but it's also leading up to the Hot Air Jubilee on Friday. What's going on with that? Yeah, absolutely. The Hot Air Jubilee has been a staple of the Jackson community since 1983. This is our 41st year. Wow. So this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, balloonists from all over our state and general area will come to Ella Sharp Park in Jackson, and then they will fly from the park or to the park. They have a competition of their own. It just doesn't have, it just doesn't come with the title of national champion at the end. Okay, so still, I mean, and this is a free event, right? So Absol everyone should come out and check out the hot air balloons? Absolutely. You know, Friday evening, the park opens at 3 o'clock, both Friday and Saturday. Okay. We'll be there till 10. We expect nice. evening flights to start around 7. Okay. Um, pending the weather, but Katie just right. gave us a great right. forecast. Yes, so, thank goodness. Yeah, and then we have the all-important and beautiful night glow, probably around 9 o'clock each evening. So okay. come to the park, enjoy, you know, pick up some food vendor snacks, bring your chair, yeah. bring your blanket, and just stay for the evening. Okay, Angela, thank you so much. We'll have all the details for you on our website shortly, WLNS.com. Angela, thank you for being here. My pleasure, thank you. We'll